there's not a lot known about Lorene, is that right? That's right. Uh, you know, she uh, is the mother of Steve Jobs' kids. She went to Wharton. She went to Stanford. Uh, she met Steve Jobs at a seminar. Um, and really, she, uh, while Steve Jobs was this gregarious and very famous and iconic CEO, she has very much uh, sort of stepped out of the lim limelight. And but both of them, of though, were not very public people. That's right. I mean, Steve Jobs was well known for his secrecy and, and not, um, you know, telling the public uh, to much criticism at sometimes exactly what was going on at Apple, um, despite being, you know, this very big and iconic figure in, in American capitalism and American technology. Do we know if she had any influence at all on Jobs while he was at Apple? You know, did she have any influence on the company itself? Um, what we understand is that she had a major impact on, or a major effect and influence on, on Steve Jobs personally, and was able to, uh, certainly after he got sick, was able to uh, sort of drive him and calm him down a lot. This is a very yeah. uh, agitated guy and a, a guy that was very, very driven. Um, and so we know that about her, but we really don't know too much about what was going on in their family life or anything like that. And she has not taken an active role in Apple since Steve Jobs passed. Mm -hmm. Okay, D despite, despite her holdings, uh, obviously. Now, right. uh, how does she compare to the other women billionaires on the index. Where does there's, she there's actually about a dozen women who are richer than her. She uh, actually is not in the top 100 right now. Uh, as of yesterday's count, she was uh, the 102nd richest person in the world. Really? Um, uh, that's because of the Apple stock going down. Even though mm -hmm. Disney stock represents $7 billion of her fortune, uh, Apple only about $3 billion of her fortune. But Apple has obviously taken uh, some steps back in recent weeks. Um, but uh, the, the richest woman in the world is Christy Walton, followed by her sister-in-law, Alice Walton. Of Walmart. That's right. There's uh, Dearce Camargo, the richest woman in Brazil. There's Elaine Marshall who owns 15% of Coke Industries. So there's lots of women who are actually richer than a small than but exclusive list. That's and exclusive right. list. Okay.